Thank you for taking the time to speak with us. Um, I'd like to begin uh, with something that you've said in your book, and that is that the, the, the devil is lodging in the Vatican. With all of the allegations we've seen recently of sexual abuse involving priests, do you believe that is the devil's work? Well, yes, the devil tempts everyone. He tempts everyone in every environment. In particular, he tempts those on top, in politics, in economics, in sport. And naturally, he tempts above all the religious leaders. So you shouldn't be surprised if the devil tempts those in the Vatican. That's his job. Have you ever performed an exorcism on a priest accused of uh, molesting a child? No, non mi è mai capitato. Ora i pedofili non sono indemoniati. No, it's never happened. Now, pedophiles are not possessed by the devil. They are tempted by the devil. They don't need exorcism. They need to be converted, to be converted to God. That's what they need. They need to confess. They need true penance, true repentance. That's what they need. They're not possessed. Now, you said we shouldn't be surprised that the devil is present in the Vatican because the devil is present in all the spheres of life. Uh, with all of the scandals we've seen recently, do you think the devil's presence is stronger today? No, it's a surprise. Il mondo è sempre andato così. I'm not surprised. The world has always been like that. The devil attacks everyone. He also attacks people who are in the Vatican. If we look at history, if we know our history, we see how many of those in the hierarchy have been attacked by the devil. It's always been that way. The devil is just doing his job. Now, some people in the church, when they talk about the devil, when they talk about Satan, they use it as a metaphor for the weakness of human beings. But you're talking about something very real, aren't you? Certo, realissima. E dico, se credete al Vangelo, credete all'esistenza del demonio. Absolutely, very real. I'm saying that if you believe in the gospel, you believe in the existence of the devil, the devil's power to possess people, the power that he has to take possession of people.